In this video, I will show you how to create macOS 15 bootable USB drive in under 4 minutes. Hello friends and welcome back to MZ Learning. Friends, a few minutes ago at WWDC 2024, Apple introduced macOS 15, the latest operating system for their Apple computer. macOS 15 offers new features, but it's currently available in developer beta, so it means it may have some bugs. But if you can't wait to test its new feature like me, then I highly recommend installing it on a separate Mac or at least on a separate volume. I have created a step by step video on this topic. The link is in the video description. And of course, this method does not require a bootable USB drive. However, if you want to try out macOS 15 on multiple computers or perform a clean installation, you will need a bootable USB drive. And here is how to create one. Let's start with step number one, in which we need macOS 15 full installer. As I said before, currently macOS 15 is available in the developer beta version. So it means it's not available on App Store. So how can we download macOS 15 full installer with or without developer ID? Well, it's very easy. I also made a separate step by step video on this topic. The link is in the video description. Anyway, after downloading macOS 15 to your application folder, move on to step number 2. In step 2, we require a USB drive with a capacity of 16 GB or higher. First we need to prepare the USB drive and then make it bootable. To do this, plug your USB drive into your Mac and once it's mounted, open your Disk Utility app. Please note. This next process will erase all data on your USB drive. So if you have any important data on it, make sure to back it up before proceeding. Otherwise, you will lose all the data on your USB drive. Anyway, in this utility, go to the view menu and select show all devices. Next, in the left sidebar, choose the top level of your USB drive and click on erase button. In the name field, choose a name for the USB drive. In the format drop down menu, select macOS extended journal. And this is the most important part, which is why we use this utility. In the scheme drop down menu, make sure to select grid partition map. Everything is okay. Now hit the erase button. After erasing, you can close the Disk Utility app. Now, open the terminal app to complete the final step. Friends, creating a bootable USB drive in the terminal is an administrator level task. That's why, first we type sudo, give a space, and then we need to type the path of the installation media file. The easy way to do this is to go to your application folder and right click on the macOS installer. Click on show package contents. Now first open the contents and then resources folder. Here you will find a file called create install media. Drag this file into your terminal window. Next type dash dash volume followed by another space and drag your USB drive into the terminal window. This will add the USB name and path in the terminal. Everything is ok. Now hit the enter key. Type your admin password and hit the enter key again. Now type Y to confirm and hit the enter key again. And that's all. The terminal will start creating the bootable USB drive. This process will take some time depending on your hardware configuration. Once the process is complete, you will receive a message like this, install media is now available. Now we have a macOS 15 portable USB drive and we can use it to install macOS 15 on any macOS 15 compatible Mac. Simply restart your Mac, hold down the power button, select the USB drive from the boot picker screen and follow the on screen instructions. So friends, I hope the video was useful. If you have any question, please leave a comment below. For more Mac related videos, 
प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू द चैनल थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग हैव ए नाइस डे